Hey guys, it's Jason Cipriani here, a CNET How-To contributor, and today we're going to take a look at how to get started with Clear. It's a new iOS task manager app that's rocketed to number one in the top paid apps in the App Store, and it has a, a, a neat looking UI and some intuitive, yet at times not so intuitive, gestures uh, to interact with the app. Once you learn them, they become extremely intuitive and easy to use, but getting over that learning curve can be a bit of a problem. So let's take a look at how to use Clear. We'll go ahead and open the app. And I have some of the default uh, tasks that are created when you first launch the app that kind of teach you how to use the app uh, still in place here, as well as some old tasks that I've checked off uh, in the past. So we'll go ahead and show you how to create a new task. You can do that by pulling down. Once you do and release, you can type in the name of the task and hit done. Now if you want to create more than one, as you're typing, you come up here instead of hitting done, you pull down again, you create another task. And you can keep doing that until you have as many tasks as you need entered. To mark a task done, you swipe from left to right. To delete a task, you go from right to left. If you want to create a task in the middle of two items, you pinch. And that creates a new task. You can also pick up one and move it around in the list, reprioritize your list. Now we have all these deleted or I'm sorry completed tasks down here at the bottom. If we want to clear those out of the list, we pull up and let go. Doing so clears everything out that we have already completed. Now if you if you begin to pull down and you pull past creating a new task, you'll actually switch to the list. And here you could create multiple lists that hold different tasks or different categories of tasks. So now we, that's kind of ironic. Uh, now we have uh, two lists here. Now if we pull down again and pass creating another list, it will switch to the menu. In the menu you can change themes, which we just unlocked the Tweetbot theme. And actually there's three total themes you can unlock here within the app. I already have a post on how to unlock those themes. Make sure to view that, I'll link to it in the post. Uh, there's two other themes that you can unlock pretty easily without having to purchase another app like you would have to here with Tweetbot. So we'll pinch back out of that. You have tips and tricks, follow the team, and then settings. And you can turn off the sound effects if those aren't your cup of tea. Now as you notice, when I'm exiting these lists, I'm actually pinching to close them. So you can either swipe all the way down until you go back to them, or you can pinch to close them out. So that's how to get started with Clear on the iPhone. It's available today in the App Store. Make sure to keep watching over at howto.cnet.com for more wonderful tech tips.